All right, solving this problem. So we've got the sine three theta of three theta is equal to negative one. So what we're going to do is take the arc sine. So we get three theta is equal to inverse sine negative one. Inverse sine negative one's down here. So it's equal to three pi over two. So three theta is equal to three pi over two. Excuse me. All right, so now what we're gonna do is divide through by the coefficient three here. So we're gonna get theta is equal to, we're gonna get pi, well this, this ends up, excuse me, this ends up being three pi over six, which is equal to pi over two. So we've got two more solutions, and the reason why is because this cycles three times as nor three times compared to what a normal sine graph would cycle between zero and two pi. So um, the other one's going to be pi over two, which is what we have here, plus two times one times pi over three. And okay, well, let me even do this. This is two pi divided by, well, okay. 2 pi and then times uh, k equals 1, so the extra move, movement there. So um, this reduces down to 7 pi over 6. And then we have pi over 2 plus 2 pi times 2, which is k equals 2. So we get pi over 2 is equal to 4 pi over 3, or plus 4 pi over 3. And that gives us 11 pi over 6. All right, so our final solution for theta is equal to pi over two, seven pi over six, and 11 pi over six. And that's it.